dear friends welcome back to my another lecture of the mathematics third for the third sum students okay subject for you already know bcs 301 so in this uh, video we will discuss about question number uh, one b as in the earlier video i have discussed question number one a so i have provided the link in the description box you can also go through varieties of problems which i have uploaded on the third sum mathematics okay <clears throat> so let us start this question in a factory producing blades the probability of any blade being defective is 0 0.02 means that uh, the blades which are defective the probability of those defective blades uh, is 0 0.002 okay if uh, the blades are supplied in packets of 10 so number of packets are given 10 using poisson's distribution Deter, uh, determine the number of packets containing no defective you have to calculate uh, the probability of these no defective and one defective two defective bla blades with respect to the 10,000 packets okay it is given in the question so by using Poisson's distribution so you have to remember one formula for the Poisson's distribution so I can write here solution P of x is equal to x is equal to e power minus lambda lambda is power x upon x factorial okay this is the formula for the poisson's distribution okay which you have to use in this question <clears throat> now what is given number of packets is given n is equal to 10 and also probability is given so p is equal to 0 0.002 it is given in the question now for lambda there is a formula lambda is equal to n p okay so lambda is equal to what is the n value 10 probability is 0 0.002 okay so you will get lambda value as lambda is equal to 10 into 0 0.002 so 10 into 0 0.002 which is equal to 0 0.02 okay so lambda is equal to 0 0.02 right this is your lambda value now put this lambda in this particular equation simply p of x is equal to x is equal to e power minus 0 0.02 lambda means 0 0.02 raised power x upon x factorial now we can calculate no defective one defective and two defective let me calculate it so see here no blades are defective out of 10,000 packets it is mentioned in the question no defective no defective uh, respectively in the consignment of 10,000 packets so among 10,000 packets I have to calculate uh, the probability for no blades are defective okay so I can write simply 10,000 10,000 into p into x is equal to 0 means at x is equal to 0 means no defective okay so i can write 10000 okay into what is the p of uh, x formula here above step e raised power minus 0 0.02 into 0 0.02 raised power x x means we have to take 0 okay 0 upon x factorial so x factorial means 0 factorial i can calculate in the kelc so see here how you have to take this so divide start this is your 10000 okay into e power shift e power minus 0 0.02 right into point bracket start 0 0.02 whole raised power sorry this is your bracket close raised power 0 means i have to take first here x simply sorry this is your raised power x alpha x upon x factorial so how to write x factorial simply alpha x okay then shift this one x factorial so you are getting this now using calc calc value you just put x value as 0 x is equal to 0 is equal to is equal to you will get 9801 for the no uh, among 10,000 packets so you will get 9801 or approximately I can write 9802 is the answer for this that is no defective okay so out of 10,000 9802 blades are no defective out of 10,000 packs okay now we have to calculate one blade defective out of uh, 10,000 so see here in the question it is mentioned one defective okay, here one defective okay so le now let me calculate one blade defective out, out of 10,000 so 10,000 into same equation e power minus 0 0.02 into 0 0.02 raised power 1 upon 1 factorial and you just calculate it by putting the value uh, same which i have mentioned above which i calculated above like that you have to calculate it you will get value approximately 196.03 okay or simply you can write 196 is the answer for this one blade defective out of 10,000 now for uh, two defectives i can write 10,000 into e power minus 0 0.02 into 0 0.02 raised power 2 i have to write divided by 2 factorial you will get the value 
when you just calculate it you will get two so two are two defective in the out, out of ten thousand over here okay so i hope this is clear to you this is all about this question so thanks for watching my video